I mean, we had, we still hadn't gotten a fun side mini in Domino. Uh, we'll check them out next time. <laughs> so we're going to final destination for our next game in Losers Top 8. Yes. HO3K Gen fighting off against King Ark. Losers going to be going down with a 7th place finish. Now, this is kind of a strange spot for Gen to be in, right? He got sent to Losers pretty early by John. Mm -hmm. Now, honestly, I would say, given the past history of these two, this is a matchup in general. We've this seen this in Grands. Season. We have seen this in Grands. Not only have we seen this in Grands, I feel like seeing King Ark this low down in top eight is something maybe not as rare as Gen, but still a very rare occurrence. Right. I mean, uh, King Ark, I wouldn't say has fallen off, per se, but has definitely not been getting into like top three, top four as much as he used to. So this is actually pretty... Like, kind of common, you know? Mm -hmm. So, you know, we just don't really see it that much because sometimes we don't get a stream all the top eight. All right. But here we go. You know, King Ark starting at 99% already. You see Jen trying to pop him up with that down so while he hangs onto that ledge. Mm -hmm. Sets him up very nicely for a free back air. Yep. Jen with the super smooth run-up uh, ledge trump, but gets it slightly too early mm -hmm. and would have gotten trumped himself so it doesn't get the follow-up. That uh, was a good conversion. My god. He threw one. the metal blade and got the flare blade right afterwards. <laughs> Even if it wasn't a true conversion, that was still a fantastic chase. Yeah. I mean, they gave him enough hits, so that looked true. Dude. All right. Go that loose. is a punish on that forward smash. A lot of end leg. And whatever momentum Jen had in that first stock is quickly being depleted by King Ark. I mean, my man's already sitting at 119, looking to try to catch him with the jumps. What's really cool about landing with an up air with Mega Man <laughs> is not only does it apply shield pressure against you, it also is a good anti air in case you want to jump out of it too, because the uh, aerial, the tornado, is still active above you. Mm -hmm. And Palutena's Reflect is a little too committal for it to have a sizable difference against that, even when landing. Okay, back throws him off stage. 143 gets oh. the footstool. Okay. I mean, the thing is, Mega Man's Rush Coil covers a lot of vertical distance, so he doesn't have to worry about it That's too tough. much. But he's going to have to worry about that back throw coming out from Jen. Absolutely. Going to take him clear off. Uh, King Ark, I think, still sitting on the momentum right now. He's got the stage. He's got the percentage lead. And uh, he's moving pretty confidently, all things considered. Okay, Flare Blade again. Mm -hmm. Tries to catch him with the cutter. Right. Very hungry. Goes backers. a little heavy on that one. So gives up stage control, and that might start giving Jen the momentum he needs to get this percentage back. Again, yeah, has him oh. off stage, looking for these back airs. Very strong of him to go for. Ooh. Whips a grab. I mean, honestly, as Palutena, she has such a good grab that like you're going to see King Art try to go for that spot dodge. He had quite the optimal punish. Goes for the sure you can up tilt. Not only that, he did the turnaround, which is yeah. tight. Yeah. Yes, sir. All right, uh, I like that. Because he threw Crash Bomb at her, forces the shield. Uh, I'm not even sure what he reflected there. All right. Perfect spacing out there. Very low risk explosive flame. More Trust. shield pressure coming out from the Leaf Shield. Trades it out a bit. 134% on King Ark. Oh, that was super smart. So Ark knew that he would have had to air dodge into the stage there, which keeps him vulnerable for, I think, five frames, if not more, depending on how stale your roll is. So he covers himself with the Crash Bomber at a perfect time. There, oh. off stage, gonna catch him out of that rush coil. Gem bringing this back bit by bit. Already sitting at 79%, though. Trying to get these detonators, couldn't get the second Nair one. Out of shield, will stop his offense in his track. Fantastic anti-air. <laughs> that was such a smooth fade back. I'm surprised he didn't get the punish off of that. That was clean. Looking pretty slick out here. Hold on. Goes for the forward smash again. Doesn't need the punish. King Arc, okay. So if he lets go of that leaf shield on shield, it's a direct punish. If he fades away or if he jumps away, then it's not a punish, but it's very much not his turn. He actually went for the shore you can as an anti-air. Mm -hmm. I love this guy. All right. Back airs again. Going to get the down throw into a back air. Kid misses the back air a little bit. It's okay. Going to be able little to touch. catch that air dodge. Uh, instant detonation on the crash bomber. That was odd. I think it's because it got hit. Oh, oh no. no. See, so that was tough, right? Because if he had gone right to the ledge, he would have gotten caught by that down smash. Um, so he was trapped. Yeah, he was trapped. I'm not sure if he could have gotten out of that, honestly. Because the thing is, when you air dodge into the ledge, it's a, you're a little bit more vulnerable mm -hmm. than a, two, a typical two frame. Just a little bit. And see, it looks like right here. He backs off. He backs off. He definitely he knows, backs off. But he can't. He can't come back with that. So he was maybe he was kind of hoping for uh, the the crash bomb. Oh yeah. Also, oh that's what it was. It was the wind hitbox. Oh, down smash, that's a fair point right? actually. Okay. Smart stuff from Jen. Very sneaky. Because as you know, like. Uh, 
whenever uh, Jen has, uh, Palutena has those wings, adds on a little bit of a wind hitbox. And neutral are trying to cover that jump out of shield, but King Arch is going to hold on to shield. Yep, and he does a good job of punishing the Nair there. Normally very difficult to punish Palutena's Nair on shield, especially at the end of it. All right, misses the Crash Bomber. That was a little bit of a sus usage there, a bit close, but... All right, Nair Train. Nair Train into the um, auto reticle follow-up. I don't see that too often, but that's not a bad call. Very low committal. Very low committal. Yeah, you're you're going to see Jen not jumping off stage too much against us. He just wants to keep the... Oh, as I said... Tries to it was a bait, you know, mm. trying to make him fe feel a little bit fearful before he jumps back onto the stage. Yes. You know, stage control is a really important thing. All right. And he's got it right now. He's setting center. All right. So gets him with the last hit there. One thirty-four percent. Looking to try to catch that neutral arrow. Cal's out with a spot dodge. Has a back air shield with his name on it. Very scary to get back from Palutena at that sort of percent. All right. Bates out the get up attack, doesn't get the full connect on the claw, which is unfortunate. And he's gonna go for a little ride on the Nair train. Everybody get your tickets out. Choo choo. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, you don't have the busy hours. You didn't pay the additional $3. You're gonna have to go back to the kiosk. My man just got sniped out of the ledge, right? This ticket is off peak. <laughs> Uh, Long Island much? Oh. <laughs> oh, I like that, I like that, I like that. Oh, no. Is he dead again? No, he Good. makes it back. I would, I would honestly be shook. I would. <laughs> I Imagine would getting three stocked that. game two. It couldn't be me. What? What? Whoa. What? What? What the? What happened to Crash Bomber? It, no. It, it like hit his shield and slowed down. Who's that again, Devin? Did you see that? <laughs> Watch this Crash Bomber, dog. That was great. It like, it like nicked the top of his shield. <laughs> Boop. What? <laughs> Yo, Mega One Man, look, Mega Man, I'm time. sorry. Mega Man, I'm sorry. I need to chill with Palutena right now. You know, I need to get with a top tier character. Watch this, watch this. What, what happened? Boop. What happened? Wait, wait. Did he, one more time, one more time on that. Did he get sparks on the Crash Bomber and the game didn't know what to do because that would have been perfect parry shield timing? What happened? What is that? 